kids of We Can Be Heroes before and after 2024. Welcome to Trendfly, and today we'll be counting down kids of We Can Be Heroes before and after 2024. Remember to like and subscribe for 48 hours of good luck, but jumping right in! Yaya Gosselin, 14 years old. Yaya Gosselin is a young actress who gained fame for her role as Missy Moreno in the movie We Can Be Heroes when she was just 10 years old. She started her career as a model for commercials and then appeared in some TV shows and movies like Peppermint, The Purge, 13 Reasons Why, and FBI. She even played a regular role in the second season of the FBI Most Wanted spinoff. Currently, Yaya is working on some new projects. She will appear in the sequel to We Can Be Heroes alongside her co-star Taylor Dooley, who played Lava Girl. She will also star in a drama called Trans Los Angeles, directed by Casey Pina. In addition to her acting career, Yaya is known for her role in the Apple TV Plus series Surfside Girls. The show is about two best friends, Sam and Jade, who try to break a curse with the help of a friendly ghost. Nathan Blair, 18 years old. Nathan Blair is a well-known actor and filmmaker now who gained fame at the age of 15 by participating in We Can Be Heroes. Before this, he appeared in Raven's Home's first episode as 6th grader in 2019 and as Young Zed in the mini TV series Best Worst Weekend Ever in 2018. At 18 years old, he is already successful, having written and directed 7 short films and appeared in several TV series and stage performances. Nathan's talent has won him awards for his performances in plays like Puffs and musicals like Sweeney Todd. Despite being a public figure, Nathan prefers to keep his personal life private, especially his dating life. He will soon be seen in the sequel of We Can Be Heroes, and his fans are eagerly waiting for it. Lotus Blossom, 16 years old. Lotus Blossom is a young actress who started acting at a very young age. She was 13 when she took on the role of a cappella in We Can Be Heroes. She is also famous for her role in the 2020 comedy drama film Magic Max. She comes from a family of martial artists and actors, including her father, Ernie Reyes Jr., and grandfather, Ernie Reyes Sr. She is now 16 years old and is following in her family's footsteps by learning martial arts from her father at West Coast Martial Arts. She is known for her acrobatic stunts and has earned the nickname the Ninja Princess. Apart from her acting career, Lotus Blossom is an animal lover who enjoys spending time at the beach, swimming, gardening, and photography. She has a dog friend named Luke Skywalker and two bunnies that she's raising on her own. Halla Finley, 14 years old. Halla Finley is a talented young actress who appeared on the big screen at just 11 years old in We Can Be Heroes as Ojo. She was born and raised in Kansas City, Missouri and has an older brother. As a child, Halla loved dancing and playing sports, but it was watching her brother prepare for auditions that inspired her to pursue acting too. Since then, Halla has appeared in several other TV shows and movies, including Man with a Plan, Backroads, and Paradise Highway, where she had the privilege of working with famous actors like Morgan Freeman, Frank Grillo, and Cameron Monaghan. In her most recent project, Halla starred alongside Ben Affleck in the 2023 action thriller film Hypnotic. Despite her young age, Halla has already made a name for herself in the entertainment industry, and her fans are excited to see what she'll do next. She is a talented and promising young actress who is one to watch. Akira Akbar, 17 years old. Akira Akbar is a young actress who was born on October 2, 2006 in the United States. At the age of 14, she landed a role in the movie We Can Be Heroes, but before that she had already made a name for herself by acting in other TV shows and movies. For instance, she played the role of Monica Rambeau in Marvel's Captain Marvel in 2019. She also appeared in the first episode of the TV series This Is Us as Young Beth. Akira is a gifted actress and her fans are eagerly waiting to see her on the big screen again. Isaiah Russell Bailey, 17 years old. Isaiah Russell Bailey is a young African-American actor, TikTok star, dancer, and model, and was born on December 9, 2006 in Fort Worth, Texas. He is known for his role as Shaka in the Netflix series Family Reunion. Despite his young age, Isaiah has already made a name for himself in the entertainment industry. 
Making his family, especially his actress mother, very proud, Isaiah's acting career was already rising, but when he was 14 years old, he appeared in the We Can Be Heroes movie. Besides acting, he is also a model and has worked with popular brands such as Nike, Skechers, Target, and GX. As a result, he has earned a considerable amount of money from his modeling contracts. One of the things that makes Isaiah stand out from other young actors is his ability to perform stunts. The 17-year-old trains in parkour at the Jam Studio, where he practices incredible stunts that leave his fans in awe. We believe that Isaiah's talent and dedication to his craft will make him a great success in the entertainment industry for years to come. Andy Walken, 17 years old. Andy was 14 when he was cast as Wheels in We Can Be Heroes, a young actor who has already made a name for himself in Hollywood. He started acting in 2015 after being discovered at a talent convention. Even though he's only 17 years old, he has already had some notable roles, including William Cleary in The Kids Are Alright and Ralphie Parker in A Christmas Story Live. He recently won an award for his voice acting in an animated show called Centaur World. Andy was born on April 26, 2006 and is originally from Washington. When he was just 5 years old, he was a competitive ice skater. Despite what some people might think, he's not related to the famous actor Christopher Walken. His most recent role was in the second episode of an action series called Gen V. Andy has already won over many fans with his talent and charisma, and people are excited to see what he'll do next. Dylan Henry Lau, 16 years old. Dylan is a young actor who started acting when he was 11 years old. You might know him from his roles in Fresh Off the Boat and Drunk History. Recently, he was cast in the movie Everything Everywhere All at Once, alongside famous actors like Michelle Yeoh, Ki Hui Kwan, and Jamie Lee Curtis. The movie is about a Chinese immigrant who gets caught up in an exciting adventure in different universes, trying to stop someone who wants to harm them. The movie did extremely well, receiving 11 Oscar nominations and winning 7, topping all other movies that year. Dylan is now 16 years old and he likes to share things on his Instagram account, which his parents help him to manage. He has lots of followers and he's been on TV shows like The Late Late Show with James Corden and Drunk History. Andrew Diaz, 14 years old. Andrew Diaz is a young actor who comes from a mixed background of Puerto Rican and Norwegian descent. Ever since he was a child, he has shown a keen interest in acting and his family has been very supportive of this passion. In 2018, they even moved to Hollywood to help Andrew pursue his dream of becoming an actor. When he was just 11 years old, he joined the cast of We Can Be Heroes. Andrew's father, who is also his mentor and acting coach, has been instrumental in helping him secure representation in the industry. Since then, Andrew has been working hard to audition for different roles and prove his worth as an actor. He is dedicated to his work and is always looking for opportunities to grow as an actor. He loves the challenge of playing different characters and hopes to touch the hearts of his audience with his performances. Vivian Lyra Blair, 11 years old. Guppy was played by Vivian Lyra Blair at the age of 8. She is a young actress and producer who became famous for her role in the movie Bird Box. She started her acting career and made her debut in the movie Band-Aid. Recently, she was praised for her role as Leia Organa in the TV series Obi-Wan Kenobi. Vivian has also been part of a video game called Telling Lies and played a role in the superhero movie We Can Be Heroes. The 11-year-old was even nominated for an award for her performance in the Obi-Wan Kenobi TV series. In her most recent work, she appeared in an episode of the psychological thriller series called Fatal Attraction. We're excited to see what project she'll be coming up with next.